Hey, it's me, Mark Del Mark at Terrytown RV in Grand Rapids, and we have an exclusive for you today, folks. An Ember RV, one of the first ones offline, brand new company out of Indiana, true off-road trailer. We're gonna tell you a little more about it here in about two seconds. So again, folks, we have the Ember RV. It's the 191 MDB. That's a middle dinette booth. Long story short, this thing has everything you would need for off-road camping. Let's start with the beginning of it. First, look at the jack here. It's not a chintzy jack. They've gone to an extra um, stable jack for true off-road camping. They've gone to a storage compartment here that has got lockable storage. You got LP on one side, folks. Look what you've got over here. Then we're gonna take you around the front. Now, a couple things to remember with Ember RV. This is true off-road. So what they've done is they've gone to a suspension package, if you can see here. It is a true independent trail rated suspension. What that's gonna do for you folks is, it's got, it's got shock absorbers, but more important, it's got lace springs. That's gonna make both arms go independently. So you can go off-roading, go two-tracking, those types of things. And then when you get there, if you want to, you can camp just about anywhere when you do, because it's got a true wheel chuck patent pending system here to keep this the wheels stable so you can camp almost anywhere you want. Of course, basic stuff we see in a lot of RVs. You got usable outlets, you got a spray port here. These things are really important to help you get some uh, um, uh, more camping. Also, we're gonna have, folks, we're gonna have outdoor griddle, outdoor fridge, so kind of an outdoor kitchen feel. Look at the size of these storage doors and level of insulation. This again is a big, big feature when you're talking about off-road camping. It's also gonna have true Asdell composite materials in the sidewall with fiberglass, and then they've gone to a Euro-style acrylic window system, which is really neat. It can be true open air, or it can be, uh, it has a screen in each one. As we've noticed, as we're gonna step inside here and look at some more stuff, you're gonna see that it has the skylight here, which you see me pop my head out of earlier. This is really, really, really important because this gives you that true camping feel when you're out in the sticks. You're also gonna have a Murphy bed. So this is really nice because you got a couple of things going for you here. If you notice here, you got a cup holder, true sofa, higher density foam cushions, gonna sit better, gonna last longer. But look how easy this is to convert. So when you're out camping, boom. It's got a little snap latch here, comes right down. Pull this forward and you're ready to camp. Don't forget about the decorative pillow. I mean, without the decorative pillow, I mean, just doesn't make it in the RV mode to my Now, we're gonna pull this right back up and show you again just how easy it is if you get a rainy day to show you folks at home just how quick and easy this works. It snaps right into place and you're right back enjoying yourself. Bingo, bango, bongo. Of course, here's the dinette that makes a bed too. Notice it's got a, a it, how it secures to the wall over here. Makes it real easy to go up and down. And then look at the, the secure points here. I've seen a lot of companies that are gonna just put a, a piece of particle board here and staple it on. These are actually screwed into place so adults can sleep here as well as children. It's gonna give you a better experience overall. Look how much window space we have along the side here. We have a window here, here. Each bunk back here has a window so you get a lot of nice airflow for the people who want a truly, truly rustic camp. Then of course we've got a Dometic 12 volt refrigerator and freezer system. A couple neat features here. Um, if you notice it's got real glass crispers. Glass holds cold butter plastic does, hence the word crisper keeps your food crisper. Deep well sink. High rise faucet. Two burner range, spark ignition. Of course we're gonna have full length drawers. Seven ply cross banded Baltic birch with ball bearing drawer guides, five piece construction. They again gave you a residential quality furniture in this coach. This bunk here is a flip up style bunk for storage. And then in the bathroom area, what they've done here is really neat. So first of all, you got tons of room here, you move around, wash your hair. They put a wooden deck under the tub so it won't bend, break, or crack the plastic leak water in your coach. It's going to support the, the base of the shower. Obviously, you can say goodbye. Of course, the level of, of quality put in this coach is unmatched in a lot of ways at this price point. 
If you look at all the features they have here, they got a tub surround. They've also got a, a, a nicer shower head you'll find in most coaches. And then of course, look at the fit and finish. They've caulked it all the way around here. Got a little extra place here uh, to put in some uh, toiletries and what have you. Some storage there, outlet for cup, for a hair dryer, blowing, uh, a blow dryer, those types of things. And then they've even went a step further and gave you a full attic fan here. You got porcelain toilet, foot flush, which is nice. You don't gotta bend over and wave goodbye if you know what I mean. <laughs> so, of course, they've already put the toilet paper holder right there, which is neat. So that's some of the inside features here. Of course, you've got direct drop, 13.5 AC. Microwave, of course, some of the basics. Um, if you notice the struts to hold the doors up, hidden hinge, a lot of neat features here. They've gone above and beyond. This is gonna be a hot selling unit for years to come, I can tell you that. Outside, we're gonna show you a few more things that really make it a true off-road camper. Of course, we got power awning. This is their Overland series. Back here, you've got some hooks there. So it comes with an attachable ladder. Of course, on the roof, we also have a solar package. So if you notice the tires here, even the spare is a Goodyear Wrangler tire. All aluminum wheel, LED lighting. It's got a trailer hitch on the back, so you can put a, a bike rack, those types of items, which is very, very, very important. Around the back here, you get another look at the clearance. So if you notice, there's a ton of clearance, and look where your plumbing is. Now, what that means for folks at home that maybe have never gone true off-roading kind of want to, that clearance is important because it doesn't matter if you have clearance here, but if you don't got the clearance right here, which you're going to track it, you're going to hit your plumbing on something. And of course, it can be a very expensive repair. It's got stabilizer jacks, the scissor style. Of course, there's another spot to uh, attach that ladder up there, which is really slick. And then a couple things they've got here. They got the Truma on-demand hot water system. So that's on-demand hot water. Of course, that's gas only when it's uh, on-demand hot water, but it heats up very quickly and gives you endless hot water assuming you have a water source, okay? Now, we also have a manifold system for the water, which is really important. So the manifold system here allows you to winterize it, sanitize it, all those types of things. Of course, you got a black water flush kit to clean out the black water tank, which helps keep those sensors clean. That, of course, tell you if your tanks are full or empty, no matter what you do, the stuff sticks to them. They read empty and they're full, full and empty. This is important to keep those flushed out and keep those sensors clean. Of course, another spot here to hook up hot and cold water. And nice thing about having it back here, creates a mud puddle here. Not in front of the coach where you might, the kids may track it in and out. Um, we also have battery disconnect in here. And of course, we also have um, our solar monitor. Um, it's got a motion sensor light on the other side of the storage door. And another, so you're not wasting electricity, leaving it on or forgetting it, stuff like that if you're doing any rustic camping. So remember, this is true off-road, better clearance, better tires, uh, all Asdell construction. It's not gonna miss any features, gives you everything you need, and it only comes in about 4,600 pounds, so easily towed by a lot of smaller SUVs if you wanted to go out and go true off-roading. Um, again, there's gonna be a stock number right at the bottom of your screen. You can click that to get more information on this coach, but click the subscribe button. We're gonna be giving you two or three videos a day is our goal right now, maybe a one, but two to three for sure, so that you guys can get with our team here at Terrytown. Again, number one dealer in the state of Michigan, 15 years running, top 10 United States, still family owned and operated since 1973. That's another reason we have the best products at the best prices for all you folks at home. Again, Mark Down Mark here, Terrytown RV, Grand Rapids, Michigan.